When most people think of a lacrosse field, they imagine something like this, a large open space larger than a football field, 110 yards by 60. But in reality, there's an entire other subsection of the sport called box lacrosse, played at places like this, Burnett Park on the west side of Syracuse. No, your eyes don't deceive you. Those are hockey boards all the way around. They put turf on top, and the impact that that box game plays on the field game is undeniable. Kids should play box first is the ball really never goes out of bounds. So that young kids playing, they go out and play the field game. They maybe a bad pass or the ball goes out of bounds, you gotta chase the ball for, you know, a couple hundred yards, go get the ball and bring it back. The box is always in play and you can just get a lot more touches, a lot more repetition uh, in the in the box game. Four Orange players spent this past summer playing in the Ontario Junior Lacrosse League, the top amateur competition in the world. I see uh, huge benefits in playing in the box game. You know, um, you don't have as much time and space, so you're, you know, it's a little bit more confined. And so, the, you know, the decision making is is a lot quicker, and uh, you know, it's a little more physical just because there's not as much time and space. So, um, you know, obviously on a field or in a box, there's not as much room to get away from uh, your defender and stuff. So. You know, even just cutting through the crease, you know, not, you know, not really tightening up. You know, kind of being able to just cut through and you know play and you know take checks and just you know kind of just keep on playing i think that just you know we we had an offense where we can just go out there and have fun and that's something that you know it's just play, playing backyard lacrosse something that i love to do so i think like just just looking at it at that perspective perspective that you know we're just going to go out there have some fun and let the plays come to us the effect of playing a summer in canada for orange attackmen joey spelina and trey deer extended off the field as well I mean, uh, I pretty much lived with Trey the whole summer, so you know, obviously, you guys can see how that went. But it was, uh, it was, uh, you know, it was good. I mean, we had a great time. And uh... this summer, we kind of spent almost every day together. Um, we lived at two separate houses, but um, there was a group. Uh, I think there were six of us, and we were either at the place I was staying at or Joey's house, and um, we basically did everything together. Uh, everything together. Um, we, whether it was golfing, going to shoot, like whatever it may be, we, we did it as a group. So it kind of kind of made uh, we kind of built like a mini family, and so it was it was good to get to know them, especially before coming playing here. This past summer is already paying off for Spelina. He leads the nation in points. Adam Gotkin, Citrus TV.